I'm Lori. I'm one of the physiotherapists here at Proactive Public Health. I wanted to talk about pudendal neuralgia today because it's a fairly common cause of pain in the pelvis. I see both men and women with this condition, and it sometimes is really debilitating. It's often much more painful to sit for lengths of time, um, and people just don't know what's going on. They've been checked out, they've sometimes had an MRI, and nobody finds anything really frustrating. Uh, I have a model of the pelvis with me today. I've removed the organs. It's a female pelvis, but for the most part this nerve is similar. The nerve comes out from the spinal cord at the back and the nerves fan on each side right and left. They branch off and one of the branches comes out just aside from the tailbone and goes in between two of these big heavy ligaments in the back that help stabilize the pelvis. And then the nerve slips into a canal, often called Alcox canal, the pudendal nerve canal, and comes forward. Branches of it innervate um, the vulva, the penis, scrotal sac, depending on male or female anatomy, and then can come down right into the anterior part of the genitals. Um, people will come sometimes with one-sided pain. They'll be really confused that they've got pain on one side of the vulva or one side of the penis and scrotal sac, but really very little on the other. This often responds really well. We work internally, we help release that nerve and give you some exercises, stretches, just gentle mobilizations for the nerve and the muscles surrounding it. Sometimes we even help you mobilize your spinal cord a little bit and it can make a big big difference in pain we send you home with some management tips that you can use on your own but if pudendal neuralgia or pain right down in the in the genital crease is part of your trouble particularly if it's worsened with sitting you may find that it's a benefit to come and have us uh, give you some suggestions